after World War II. Um, sort of just at the time that the last hosiery mill shut its doors, a different kind of labor market battle was ensuing, with participants relatively new to the neighborhoods of North Philadelphia. Um, with the exception of cleaning staff, hosiery firms, like almost all of the textile firms in the city, employed an all-white workforce. And as African Americans entered the neighborhoods where their mills were located, in increasing numbers during and after the war, they quite naturally looked for employment opportunities there. That was what Barbara Holly did when she went to the Roger and Crawford textile mill in Kensington. But she never made it inside the plant, let alone interviewed for a position. The plant manager saw her waiting outside the gate of the plant and questioned why she was there. When he heard that she was applying for a position, he said, quote, I definitely will not have any color here. I will close